I just want to express something to you guys. But this is Zach, so I'll bring you another video here today. And by the way, how is life? Because right now, life is going pretty good right now, you know? So ever since I've been doing my channel a little bit differently, I have been kind of been a commentary channel. I don't know why I did that, but commentary where I basically put other people's videos in my videos that I talk about them and just like the new YouTube thing that people hate or people love and I'm apparently doing it now. Now since I said a lot of people hate them and a lot of people don't like them, there's videos also on the internet about people who rant about them and people who talk about them. And by talk about them, they love them like they love them. I don't even know, but I've never seen any videos, but I'm assuming there's like a good amount of people who actually like these kind of videos in the YouTube in joke <coughs> webs. You guys see that dab? That wasn't even the dab, but I was like, bah! Yeah. Now a video that I'm about to show you guys isn't towards me, it's towards another bigger, towards bigger commentary channels. But I'm gonna act like it's towards me because you know, I'm becoming a commentary channel. And you know, it makes me feel nice inside that people make videos about me, even though it's not about me. But you know, that self-esteem has to be high for the time alive. Getting all musically on you guys. So let's get right into it. Dylan the Hacker, today I am expressing my hatred toward commentary channels. These people are untalented clickbait artists with no skill in life making videos because they can't get a real job. Okay, first of all, he said they are talentless clickbait artists. Okay, he said talentless clickbait artists with no skill in life. But he just said talented clickbait artists with no skill. Isn't that a skill though? I actually take that as a compliment even though I don't use clickbait or I like to think I don't use clickbait but some people say I don't use clickbait some people I do I mean some people say that I do use clickbait either way either way I take that as a compliment people say I'm really good at clickbait that means they click the video because of the bait that it did there that wasn't eventually that wasn't meant to be there but even if it was there and I meant it you still click the video which is great because it's a clickbait because you know it's all trap these are the type of people that make YouTube cancer next to Let's Players, React Channels, and Ranchers. The ones that stand out to me are Pyrocynical, Luna, and Leafy is here. And RJ Zach, so. <laughs> Today I'm focusing on Pyrocynical and Luna. And RJ Zach, so. <laughs> I'll make a video about Leafy another time. And RJ Zach, so. Now, if you aren't aware of commentary channels, these are the people that come from Twitch that talk about big topics and other things over gameplay. Whoa, whoa. Did you just call me gameplay? Like, I'm putting your video over gameplay? Dude, I'm not, my, my face is not some just pretty face and my body is not something you just mess with, okay? Look, I don't want another pretty face. I don't want just anybody hold. I don't want my love to go to waste. I want you and your beautiful soul. That was a reference to something that most kids will understand. And if you do understand it, you're great. But if you don't understand it, you're also great. Because that is like from 2004 and BTW. It's a Jesse McCarthy reference. But I hope you got that because, you know, as we are kids and nowadays, you know, we, we have to know the olden days things, you know? Um, yeah. It really takes no effort at all to make a video like that. And that's why I hate them so much. It's despicable to me. All they do is give their unwanted opinions. Do you guys want my unwanted opinions? Well, you shouldn't. Well, you should. Because my opinions are pretty unwanted. You know, they're pretty wanted, dead or alive. I mean, they're not wanted, dead or alive. I can come to you the next day. You can be like, yo, I don't need your opinions. And you can be like, yo, your opinions are trash. But the fact of the matter is, I'm not going to stop giving my opinions. Because the, the time I stop giving my opinions is the time that will come that are alive. So here I am, telling you what I think. I'm warning people to not be fooled by these puppet masters. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. You just called me a puppet master. Well, it's not me, but if I'm becoming a commentary channel, I am considered a puppet master. Keyword there, master. Puppet master. So here's how you avoid them. One, avoid videos where the title is in all caps. Okay, bro, we get it. All caps is clickbait. Even though your video is a clickbait right there. Thank you. Two, avoid videos with interesting thumbnails. You guys think my thumbnails are interesting? Interesting? Yeah, uh, I, I kind of say weird, don't I? But do you guys think my thumbnails are interesting for you to click them? Well, thank you. 
I like to think my thumbnails are pretty cool too. And three! If you've clicked on the video already and it begins with gameplay or it begins with I just want to express abort immediately! Oh no. Or it begins with I just want to express abort immediately! Dylan the Hacker, today I am expressing my hate. I just want to express something to you guys. Wow, he predicted the future. Now unfortunately these helpful tips won't steer you away from these thieves. They always manage to catch you in their web one way or another. They're like the Spider-Man of YouTube. Oh, Spider-Man. He just called me a thief and Spider-Man. Like, I know I stole your heart, girl. Because I'm Spider-Man. Yeah. But not like Spider-Man 1 or 2. More like Spider-Man 3 or the Amazing Spider-Man series with Andrew Garfunkel. As your leader and therapist, I instruct you to only watch my videos. And mine. He forgot to say that, but RJ Zaxos too. You know. Shh. They would never be cancerous. Of course, some of you are rebels and will venture off onto other YouTube channels. This is why I am taking Pyro Cynical and Luna and RJ Zaxo. Off of YouTube. I'm like the Trump of YouTube, and you two are fired. Don't believe me? Just watch. Just you wait and see. I've already began my YouTube takeover, as I mentioned passionately in my previous video. I'll link who I already hacked in the description below. Let the hacking commence! Ah -ha -ha! Now the video ends there with him hitting himself with the coke. But what you guys don't see, this guy is actually a really good troll. Like, I don't know if anybody takes his video seriously, or if... But this guy is actually really good. He... Does he hates on videos and hates on people, and he got like 50,000 subscribers, which is amazing for the dude. And everybody knows he's trolling because he said don't use like, don't use like clickbait stuff, but this video right here was pretty clickbaity. I have no hate for the dude, I just applaud, because you know, this is a really good job right here. But the one thing I don't like was he didn't say RJ Zaxel once. Like that's pretty offensive to my heart. It makes me feel like a pretty face. One to not get a hold. One to not get the love spent. Want to not get your beautiful soul. So, to support me and get my beautiful soul, leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. Because if you haven't subscribed, I mean, <laughs> you're hurting my soul. <laughs> and this has been a video, guys. If you. This has been a video, guys. This video here is going to end in 3, 2, 1. This has been a video, guys. And this video is going to end in 3, 2, This. This has been a video, guys, and this video is going to end in 3. This has been a video, guys, and this video is going to end in 3, 2, 1. Thank you for watching this clickbait video.